understand you and your mother have a great love for animals that you share? Yes, that's absolutely Did right. you grow up with pets? Tons of dogs and cats, mostly. He would bring me a half a rat, like once a week at least. <laughs> You mean he, he shared it with you? Oh, absolutely. And is that the Fantastic. secret to your success? Well, there's no doubt it what little success I have, you know, that's exactly it. We watched you for eight years on New Heart, and it was a tremendously successful show. I mean, it had great ratings. He has put in over 50 years into the health and fitness and bodybuilding industry. And from the bottom of our hearts at the Infinite Power Workout, we want to award him. And you know, I want to say one thing, that your show, the information you have to offer to people, they couldn't get any better information no matter where they go. But I'm sure you could give us some pointers. First of all, we do the Klingon salute. Oh, the Klingon salute. Make a okay, fist. okay, okay. You put it right yes, over you here. you are Klingon, Oops. actually. And you say, Kapla! 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 Now let me see, were you spitting enough? Did you spit? Tell me, first you played Roxanna Troy? Oh, Is no. Right? First, first I played um, number one, which was in the very first pilot. I have this great theory that a winner always knows he's a winner before he wins. Right. You already know in your mind. What you perceive and conceive in your, your mind, you can achieve it. Mm. I don't even know what half of these spices are, so show us how you do it. I'm going right. to learn how to do this. Well, we're going we're gonna to make it easy for you, see, and for the viewers out there. So how did you get involved with Best Friends? Uh, a friend of mine introduced me to them. <laughs> Especially Night Shift, actually. That's, that's one of my favorites. That was a great one. Michael Keaton, that was a fabulous one. Anyway, how did you get involved? Well, you know, animals are very important to me. And we're here doing our interview with T.J. Hoban. Sexy underwear model, sexy <laughs> lips, sexy abs. <laughs> so... Actor, too. <laughs> and an actor, yeah, of course. Is it true you used to be a geek? <laughs> Still am. <laughs> <laughs> so you recently did an episode for the new Love Boat that Aaron Spelling is producing. How yes. was that? Oh, it's great. It was a lot of fun. You know, my agent called and said, uh, would you like to go on a cruise? So definitely the secret to your success has to do with compassion. Well, some people would call it the common touch, but I don't believe there's anything common about it at all. No, I don't either. I think it's awfully special. You're a special man. But we both know you're not going to use all this stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Whenever I do a chest workout and I feel like I just haven't gotten enough yet, I shouldn't be done yet, after I do the push-ups, I go, I'm done, that's it. So anyway, here, we'll do some push-ups for you. Let's move those feet. Let's move those feet. Okay, now Benjamin's going to stand on your back. Okay. Exactly, that comes now, right? Actually, what I'm going to do, I'm going to do some special ones for you. Interesting. <laughs> Two. Yeah. Three. Woo! Boy, that's, if I've done more of those, I've done a thousand. Am I right? That's oh my God! Boy, are show. you gonna be sore tonight, yeah. buddy? Okay. <laughs> we're here with Maureen McGovern, and we're gonna do one more nice workout segment. Maureen brought her ball with her today, and she does this yes. workout. Swing, swing, and so swing. she's going to show swing, us what she swing. does, and some of us are going to follow. There's no hope for Lee. During my pregnancy, honey, I gained a lot of weight, <laughs> and I had a lot of fun. So how big were you, like 140, 150? No, no. About 36 pounds. So, Tiffy, you're taking on the Senate with a new bill. <laughs> what needs to happen is a federal law has to be passed. Which one is this? This is uh, Antonio Banderas. <laughs> When did it become apparent to you that Hitchcock was obsessed? He wouldn't take his eyes off of me. That's what I'm talking about, huh? Woo! I love you, girl. Did you have any good time? Go! 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 And now wait for the great bikinis all the girls are wearing. Uh -huh, uh -huh, pick up. <laughs> Give me a shirt. No, no.